Hi, I'm Al Sutherland with your Mesonet Weather Report. Well, this week's topic was all about rain. Welcome rainfall that came across the state and really helped move a lot of areas past thinking about drought from last year and really beginning to think about good crops for this year. Taking a look at our rainfall map from Wednesday, the eastern half of the state, those tan, orange, and red areas, three inches to some areas as much as seven inches of rainfall. That green area in the western half of the state, that is below two inches, but generally a very widespread across that area. And then there's those few areas in yellow, which are two to three inches. As you drive across the state, you'll see lots of green growth this year. And that's what we show on our 24 inch soil moisture map. The green, those are wet, moist areas. And we can see the vast majority of the state as we move from east out to west, very dark green, good soil moisture down at that two foot depth. There are those areas that are still short out in Texas County in the Panhandle, Beckham County in the western part of the state, and then Jackson County in the southwest. The green theme continues with our Keech Bryram drought index, and this is on a scale of zero being wet, 800 being dry. We can see all of those zeros, all the green on the bulk of Oklahoma, starting in the east and moving to the west. As we move into that western area, we start picking up some dry areas, Jackson County in the southwest, Beckham County in the west, and then over in the panhandle, Hooker comes in at a dryness scale of 692. Turning to the Climate Prediction Center outlook for April, we can see that the precipitation chances are equal chance, and that means there's really no indication of where things are going to go. They could be below normal, could be near normal, or above. No indication. The temperature outlook for April is more definitive. There is an increased chance for above average temps. Checking in on the drought outlook from March 15th out through June 30th, we can see that the new outlook shows a improving drought situation for most of Oklahoma as we move out towards the west, right on the edge of Texas, and then into the panhandle, there's some improvement with persisting drought as we look into the far area of the panhandle. That wraps up this week's Mesonet Weather Report. Thanks for joining us.